Hello and welcome. This is the scene here at Molyneux. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And on Christmas Day, our gift to you is what we hope will be a top-quality football match. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers up against Manchester United. But at the moment, no present from you, Derek. Um, it's coming later, I promise. Uh, I think that was the answer you gave me last year. Still, this game will be a treat for everybody. I have to say, as a football fan, I love this time of the year. With the fixtures coming thick and fast, it's great stuff. And number 11, And here's the Wolves lineup. Mario Lemina starts alongside Ruben Neves in the center of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Davi De Gea stands between the posts. Harry Maguire plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. Fred starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And they kick off here. Rafael Varan. Fred. Aaron Wan Bisaka. And Wolves will get the throw in. Lemina Fofana with it committed challenge and the assistant referee with the flag raised well you just question if he could have let that run he must have known he was offside Well, when you have the best defensive record in the league, it's a sign of genuine togetherness. And that's what United keep on showing, Stuart. Well, their defensive game plan is second to none this season. And that comes down to the coach and his work on the training field. That doesn't happen by chance. This is planned, practiced and perfected on a daily basis. Well, it was almost the ideal pass, but out of play it goes. Nathan Collins. Here's Lamina. Read it well. Well, foul play, says the referee. Adama. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And he might be through here. And a goal! Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. And Wolves get us moving again. Certainly a swift response required after the setback.
cross could be useful. And it goes! Two goals in rapid-fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. Well, here we can see just how good the cross from Rashford was. But the finish is so easy. He's given far too much time and space. He doesn't even have to jump. Poor defending, you have to say. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Well, I understand there's been a goal in the Fulham match and Alex Scott has the details. It's a goal for West Ham. They've scored the opener here with 16 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. Offside, close one. It's been pretty well impossible to escape all the news stories surrounding him ahead of today's match. Well, since it's his first start here today, a big day, of course. What was that experience like for you, Stuart? Well, I certainly enjoyed my debut, but it can be the... And he's made headway! And it's there for him. A goal! Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. And the referee blows for a foul. It is a decent looking attack here. Rashford in the middle. And the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Really good challenge. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Dunk. Lemina. Ruben Neves. He's in with a chance. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Oh, it's gone in. And that will be written down as an own goal. No wonder he's hanging his head. Well, no question about this. As you can see, this will go down as an own goal. A lopsided contest, 4-0. He's given the ball away. Well, not great from the keeper. Tries to lift it. Well, what can we say? All's well that ends well. Well, he's just about recovered the situation. That could have been very embarrassing. Haber. It's 
Still looking to get the shot off. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Ruben Neves. He quartered the attack illegally. Now perhaps a card is forthcoming. But I think he knew that was coming. Yellow card it is. Well, that was always going to happen. He needs to control himself now, otherwise it could get worse. Well, in the end, nothing really to worry the keeper about. Oh, big chance! And that's the hat-trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again, they simply can't handle him! Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. But really, the goalkeeper should never be exposed that easily. Great team goal, but woeful defending. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Just hearing something has happened at the Emirates. Let's find out what. Here's Alex. It's a goal for Arsenal. It was a low driven cross into a crowded area, but he was there from close range to finish that move off. They've scored the open up with under five minutes left to play till half time. Thanks for the update, Alex. Great opportunity. That'll be a United throw. And clears the danger. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. He's given it away. Counter-attacking, very much an option. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned here in the West Midlands. So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Fred. Anthony. Bruno Fernandes. Now the pass not finding its target. Seco Fofana. Here's Lemina. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Shielding the ball superbly. Excellent ball over the top. Just cleared away in the nick of time. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers facing Fulham. And there's the feed into the box. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. 
throw in for Wolves here. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. To be replaced by number 21, Pablo Salabia. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Well, they've given him too much space. Right, I'm hearing something has happened in the Forest game. What exactly? Alex Scott. It's a third for Liverpool. They're now three ahead with 57 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Nicely timed tackle. Chance here. Oh, there it is. It's one goal after another. And it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. Well, it's an out-and-out out pasting. 6-0. Now, options are plenty. A real opening now. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, just look at this again. It's good movement. The timing of the pass is perfect. And they leave the goalkeeper with no chance. That's an excellent goal. Manchester United, number eight, Bruno Fernandes. Wang Hee Chan. Espino. United come away with it. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Number seven, Ismail Benikar. Don't forget we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester United taking on Liverpool. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. A foul, but advantage played. Ruben Neves. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. And just receiving news of a goal at the Etihad, Alex Scott, what can you tell us? And it's the second goal for Manchester City. They're pulled ahead by two with 20 minutes left on the clock. Cheers, Alex. And Casemiro, his pass gobbled up. Ruben Neves. Now can they counter clinically? They've lost it. Well, it could be on for him here. The net is staring him in the face. He takes aim. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. Number 18, Casemiro. 
to be replaced by number 33, Brandon Williams. Marcus Rashford in position. But it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Ruben Neves. Ten minutes to go then. It's with Ruben Neves. And unable to keep possession. And he has options available. Let's fly here. And it's come off the keeper. Juan Bisaka. That is how to apply the pressure. And a poor ball. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural pause before booking him. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Ruben Neves. And on the ball, Sarabia. Well, he likes to run at them. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge. And it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. And he's been dismissed. This will be a real test of their defensive resilience. Well, he had to go, didn't he? They'll need to reshape their defence quickly here. Good high up the pitch. Just the challenge that was required. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Well, these fans are demanding much more here. They have to start winning the ball back quicker. At the moment, they're too easy to play against. De Tomas. And there it is, the final whistle. It's a Manchester United victory. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with...